Hi there, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. I want to do a video today showing how to open up multiple bookmarks in Google Chrome. Now, there are other videos on YouTube and they're all suggesting, you know, put on these Chrome extensions for opening up multiple bookmarks. And that's fine, you can absolutely do that, but there's actually no need to do that. All the functionality for uh, quickly opening multiple bookmarks is already baked into Google Chrome. And I always think if there is functionality in Chrome, it's better to use it because every extension you're going to be running in the background, if you go into your Chrome task manager, you'll see that it's a different process that's consuming a little bit of memory. So as a general principle, if you're looking to use Google Chrome and not have it bog down all your RAM on your computer, because Chrome is a RAM heavy web browser, then you want to actually minimize the number of extensions you're running. You don't want to be running a ton load of extensions all the time on your computer. Uh, so what I'm going to do today is show how to do this. Now you might be asking, well, why would we want to be opening, why would I want to be opening up a bunch of uh, different Chrome bookmarks? So the use case I'm uh, setting this up for is job hunting. So if you're going to the same five or six job boards every morning, you might be like me and you just Google, let's say remote marketing jobs and you just click into the same six or seven URLs every single time. Now that's not, a smart way to do it. Um, that's kind of a use case and there would be other ones as well. So what I'm going to do now is just shift my screen across into Chrome's bookmark manager. I'm going to add a few bookmarks and then show you how this works. So um, here is a list of uh, remote job boards that I found myself. Uh, at least, sorry, these, these are the marketing jobs pages on a mark, remote jobs boards. And um, I actually posted this a few days ago on Reddit. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, people very helpfully chipped in with their own uh, job boards I missed. So this is kind of almost a crowdsourced project, you could say. So what I've done here is on my bookmark bar in uh, Chrome, I keep a few bookmarks. And you can see there's one called J, that's uh, short for jobs, remote telecommute. And I've just created one called remote marketing jobs. And here is where I've just navigated into it now in Bookmark Manager. If you don't know how to find Bookmark Manager, you can just type into the Omnibar Chrome um, hyphen forward slash forward slash bookmarks, or you can find it in the menu here. Um, so go into Bookmark Manager, and now I'm just gonna put in a few bookmarks. Now, the way you're probably more familiar with creating bookmarks in Chrome is by uh, Control D or clicking on the star icon. You can also do it this way too. So. Let's start with that remote.co and go add new bookmark and call this remote.co. So this is the manual methodology for adding bookmarks in Chrome. Uh, let's call this guy, we work remotely. Let's just do three for the purposes of keeping it simple for this demonstration. Add new bookmarks. I'm sure nobody wants to watch me adding bookmarks all day into my Chrome. Okay, so I've just gone ahead now and I've added three bookmarks. And if I go into J, remote telecommute, remote marketing jobs, you can see I've now got three new bookmarks there. Don't ask what all these other bookmarks are. My bookmark manager is a mess. Uh, I try to update it once a year if, if, if I'm lucky. Now, here's what you can do. Right click on remote marketing jobs and you have four options. I'm just gonna explain what those different options are. Now, the first one is probably all you're gonna want, open all. That's just gonna open these three in uh, the current Chrome window you have. There's also open three in new window, and that's gonna open them in a new window. Uh, finally, there's open three in incognito window. That'll be opening the three in an incognito window. I know this is self-explanatory, but just explain what they all do, because this last one's interesting. Open all three in a new tab group. So if you haven't used tab groups in Chrome before, it's actually a really useful feature. Um, I'm just gonna show you both. So let's just go for open all three. And as you can see, that's kind of what probably 90% of people are happy with. It's just opened up those three bookmarks into our current window in Chrome. Now, uh, if I want to do open all three in a new window, that's kind of handy too. If you just wanna keep everything separate, you wanna keep your one main Chrome window for your actual day-to-day -day browsing and then just do all that kind of nasty, tedious job hunting stuff in another window, then you can do it like that. I'm not gonna show incognito because it's just obvious. Uh, it's the same thing, but it's an incognito window. But 
But the last one's interesting if I click on open all three in a new tab group. So if you haven't used tab groups in Chrome before, it's a really cool feature. Uh, as you can see, it's basically creating a division sort of on your window uh, for a group of similar tabs. You can give it a little color. I'm gonna call, I'm gonna call mine uh, yellow. So you can see I've got now a little divider here, yellow divider, and to the right of my divider are my three tabs. And if I click on the tab group icon, I can open up those tabs. And if I double click, no, single click, open, closed, open, closed. Uh, and I can right click, give it a different name. Let's just say jobs. Um, and uh, what I can do now is I can ungroup it and that takes away the tab group. So if I go back now, one, two, three, uh, J remote, remote, remote. I'm gonna open the, open the tab group up again. Here's my tab group back. I can give it a different color. I can give it a different name. And I can also do a close group or I can add new tab to that group or I can move the tab group to a new window. So let's say I'm done with my job hunting for the day. So I'm gonna close out that tab group and all the tabs at once are gonna close. So those are basically, that's actually a ton of functionality built into Chrome. I would suspect as much as 90% of people need for opening up multiple URLs at a time. If you're doing something like job hunting, you don't want to be going in every morning, clicking on the same six or seven links. This should speed up what can be a tedious process. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to get more videos from me about technology, Linux, and other subjects, please feel free to subscribe to this YouTube channel.